So to do that, we're going to try to match these up. Now, what we don't show here is the 940, the net form 940, which is the year end form. And that's because it's reporting FUTA, which is just a uh, tax for, it's an employer only tax and therefore not reported on the W-3. It is possible for us to kind of compare the FUTA wages, but we still have to do some reconciling to make sure that we're picking up the correct wages on, FUT, on the FUTA form, which is a yearly form, the form 940. So common misconception would be that the quarterly forms, the 941s, the IRS wants us to report everything quarterly and then summarize that same information again on the yearly form 940. Not necessarily the case, the forms 941s report the three main taxes, the big taxes, the FIT, federal income tax, social security, and Medicare, which the IRS wants to see on a quarterly basis, whereas the form 940 reports a tax that's usually a lot smaller, FUTA, federal unemployment tax, and therefore the IRS is happy or content enough, I guess, just to see that reported on a yearly basis rather than on a quarterly basis. So they're actually two different things we're reconciling there. So if we look at what we have, these, we have quarter three and quarter four. In this example, we only have two quarters rather than four quarters, and that'll make it a little bit easier for us to show how this reconciling process would work. If we had four quarters of data, then of course we would just add up the four quarters of data. So on the 940s over here, this box, box two, is the wages and tips uh, box. And these are really wages and tips for FIT calculation, meaning this and this for the two quarters should add up to this box one. So if we were to tie this out to double check everything at the end of the year, we're going to say, okay, the 91425.1 plus the 135909.9 should add up to the 227.335. And you might even, I even subtracted sometimes, 227.7.335 uh, minus that should go to zero. So that would tie out. And then we're taking a look at the federal income tax withheld box three should tie out to the federal income tax box two on the W3. Now, again, you can't tie this number to this number because it's too complicated.